Hey, how are you guys doing? Welcome back once again to the Tech of Tomorrow YouTube channel, bringing you tomorrow's technology today. So you guys have seen it when I showed you guys a video of my lab. It was kind of dirty the first time around. We've cleaned it up, but we also had to make some changes. Due to the fact that all these new cards are coming out are so freaking powerful, they need high resolution monitors. So you guys have seen on my over motherboards.org channel, I've used a 30 inch monitor a lot. Well, started looking around for another monitor that was a little bit more affordable because that monitor actually put me back $1,600 to buy that. Now, I still wanted a monitor that had 2560, but I couldn't find one for anywhere near the same price range as that. So I went for looking for lower ones, found one. This is a 27 inch IPS backlit monitor from the people over at HP. Basically, this is a totally new school, 27 inch monitor, has all the latest ports and everything, including display and all that. 2560 by 1440 resolution. Got it for under 700 bucks. Pro style, at least I'm thinking so. But anyways, I got my knife right here. I'm gonna take the knife, flip the thing on the side here, make a couple insertions. Don't try this at home. Like I said before, I am a doctor. Go ahead and open it up. You guys see how it comes packed? It's like a monster. Yeah, I'm going to eat you. Yeah. It's the HP monster. It's like the Loch Ness, only in a box. Go ahead and set this down. That doesn't seem to be working all that grand, so. Actually, a little loud damage there. Still at the camera. Oh. That's right, it came right at the camera, too. That probably came out good. All right, take this. Little sound effects here. Woo! Toss that out of the way. All righty then. Let's go ahead. Let's see here. Uh, I don't know if you guys can see this quite quite that well. All right, after a little second of re-angling there, you guys can see we start off. We got the panel obviously right here on this plastic stuff here. I'll get back to this, but right down to the unboxing, so you want to see what comes in the box. So I'll just set this off to the side over here. Got one more layer of foam here. Go ahead and take that. We have the stand. We'll go ahead and take that out of this little plastic bag. There we go. Nice little stand for the monitor there. You guys see the bottom. I'll actually set this thing up for you guys and show you it in the video. That'd be crazy not to. So go ahead and move that out of the way. Let's see what else comes inside the box. There are different options also you can get with this folks. You can actually get a speaker bar that mounts on the bottom of this. I'm actually thinking about getting it because it would save ergonomically on my desk and I'd have some speakers, mostly in the headphones, but it would work. They actually show all those different options back here in the back. Dryer CDs inside of here. Go ahead and just go ahead and toss that up to the back. Now, we have power cable. Gives me the power. And let's see here. Here we have the DVI cable. You guys can see that, you guys know what that is. We have a USB cable. We also have neighbors walking by with their whining, crying children, so. Shut up! And then last but not least, the last cable that comes in here. And I'm actually thinking this is going to be pretty cool. I think these guys actually gave me a display port cable. Oh, hell yeah. Yep. Now, this is the first monitor that I personally have ever purchased that came with its own display port cable. So I'm trying to get this out of the little wrap here. So check this out, folks. Comes the display port cable. Rock and roll. And let's show you guys the panel. Go ahead and pull this thing out. Show you guys the back of the panel. Now I'm just gonna go ahead and set this thing down real quick. Um, takes a very long time to assemble. Very pain in the ass. You guys saw that, how hard that was. Very hard. I'm gonna just wanna complain right now to HP. Now honestly, that was like the easiest thing in the world. A monkey could have done it. All right, folks, let's check it out. Let me go ahead and take these little side little flippies off of here. Side stickies. I'm not trying to damage my monitor. All right, folks, now that we got the monitor out of the box, let's just take a look at this thing. You can see 27 inches, IPS technology, model number over here. So here's the model number right here. It's the HP ZR2740W. That's the model number. Over here, we have the menu display. All the menu keys are on here. Those will all be nice to operate the monitor. Uh, this side over here, we have nothing at all on it. There are no connectors on this side. You can see there's a nice bezel all the way around the, the entire monitor. It's very nice and elegant looking. The stand functions 
aren't all that much. You have about this much movability on it. Here on the side of the monitor, we have two USB ports. Now I'm gonna flip the monitor again onto its back. You guys can see right here, here's the, the power on button. We can turn it on. Here's the power cable comes in. As you move across over here, you can see all the various different connections. And so that's pretty much it, folks. I mean, I got this monitor for the test station. I can't wait to see how it looks. This is a new awesome 27 inch IPS monitor, backlit, great resolution. I can't wait to see how the actual, the damn thing looks in the lab. Thanks for watching the unboxing and first look here at Tech of Tomorrow.